In Thomas Aquinas's monumental work, Summa Contra Gentiles, Volumes 1 to 4 in 5 books, the influential philosopher theologian meticulously constructs a comprehensive defense of Christian doctrine. Spanning five books, this treatise serves as a profound intellectual engagement with non Christian beliefs, offering a systematic elucidation of Christian theology. Aquinas embarks on an ambitious endeavor, endeavoring to engage not only believers but also skeptics and non Christians. His aim is to expound upon the truths of Christian faith, employing philosophical reasoning accessible to those who might not share his religious convictions. He approaches this task with a blend of scholastic rigor and profound philosophical insights, inviting readers into a realm where reason and faith converge. The work structure is both intricate and deliberate. Across the volumes and books, Aquinas meticulously develops his arguments, establishing foundational principles before delving into complex theological concepts. He utilizes a dialectical method, anticipating objections and addressing them with precision and depth. This approach allows him to engage with potential adversaries, demonstrating the coherence and validity of Christian beliefs. Central to Summa Contra Gentiles is Aquinas's exploration of the nature of God. He presents God as the ultimate cause and prime mover, establishing his existence through rational inquiry. Aquinas employs a combination of philosophical reasoning, drawing from Aristotelian and Neoplatonic thought, and theological insights rooted in Christian revelation. His arguments seek to reconcile faith and reason, asserting that both avenues lead to an understanding of God's existence and attributes. Moreover, Aquinas grapples with the relationship between faith and knowledge, emphasizing the compatibility of faith and reason. He contends that while faith transcends human reason, it is not contrary to it. Instead, faith complements reason, guiding individuals toward deeper truths inaccessible by reason alone. In this way, Aquinas advocates for a harmonious coexistence of faith and rational inquiry, fostering a holistic understanding of the divine. The work's breadth extends beyond metaphysical inquiries, addressing moral and ethical considerations. Aquinas expounds upon the human condition, discussing the nature of human beings, free will, and the pursuit of happiness. He argues for the existence of an objective moral order grounded in God's divine plan, advocating for virtuous living guided by reason and illuminated by faith. Throughout Summa Contra Gentiles, Aquinas engages with various philosophical and theological concepts, including the soul's immortality, the problem of evil, and the divine providence. His adept use of philosophical reasoning intertwined with theological insights demonstrates his commitment to fostering dialogue and understanding between different intellectual traditions. In conclusion, Thomas Aquinas's Summa Contra Gentiles, volumes 1 to 4 in 5 books, stands as a testament to his intellectual prowess and commitment to elucidating the truths of Christian faith. Through meticulous argumentation and a synthesis of philosophy and theology, Aquinas constructs a formidable defense of Christian doctrine. His work continues to inspire dialogue and contemplation, inviting readers to explore the intersection of faith and reason while engaging with the profound mysteries of existence.